video demonstration of how to program a PLU product on the Casio SES 3000 cash register. First of all you need the manager key and you need to turn it round to the PGM position. Once in PGM, if you press the arrow down button once, PLU setting will be highlighted. You press cash amount 10 twice and this will then bring up a list of all the PLUs you can program on the machine. This demonstration will just pick PLU number 1 which is already highlighted. So we press cash amount tend. You can then use the arrow up button until PLU001 is highlighted. This is the default description of the product, so this is what appears on the receipt and on the screen every time you sell the item. So we'll program ours to be crisps, just for the demonstration. So you can simply type in the name of your PLU using the department keys, which have the alpha characters at the front. You can use the delete button, which is the decimal point button, to get rid of any leftover text. You then press the arrow down button till price is highlighted. To give your item a price, you simply type in the price without pressing any decimal point. The till will input that automatically. You can set the taxable status for the product by pressing cash amount end and then choosing one of the tax rates. If you're not using tax on the till or that is a non-taxable product then you just leave that blank. You can assign, you can link the PLU to a group, you can link it to a department. For, for this demo we'll just link it to department 1 by highlighting the department link number and pressing number 1. The last setting is open PLU which means it's a, a PLU with a variable price. We've already preset ours to be to have a price so we'll leave open PLU as no. Once you're happy with your settings for the PLU, you press subtotal. This will bring you back to the main PLU menu. So you could, if you wanted, use the cursor down key and carry on programming more PLUs. For this demonstration, we'll leave it with one programmed. You press subtotal twice to return to the main PGM menu. And we can turn the key back around to register position. If you're in receipt mode with the receipt switched on, you'll get a receipt printout confirming your new PLU name and the price. And then in the register position, if we sell one PLU, we can see it's come up on the screen with crisps at the preset price. For more technical support on the SES 3000, please visit cashregisters-uk.co.uk. For till rolls and other cash register supplies, please visit shopstuff.co.uk. Thanks for watching.